Okay, the computer is starting and it will show two operating systems. Okay, that's the BIOS and now the menus should show up. Okay, and one of these operating systems, Windows 10, is not starting. So this one is okay, Windows 7, and that one, if I press enter, I receive this long error message. And this is the important one, Windows cannot verify the digital signature for this file. So let's see how to fix this problem. I press enter, nothing useful happens. So luckily there's another one, Windows 7. I'm going to enter that Windows and I'm going to fix the other one from within this one. Okay, now in Windows 7 let's go to the start button and type in CMD cmd from the command prompt and click on the command prompt okay it has administrator privileges already and in this window type in bcd edit bcd edit and press enter okay now on this larger window we have windows boot manager windows boot loader a Windows boot loader and at the loader section we have at description we have Windows 7 that one is started right now and the other one at Windows loader and description Windows 10 the one which did not started so basically these are from that uh, operating system selection menu Okay, and to fix this one, to disable that signature verification, type in BCD edit once again, BCD edit and minus set, minus set, and we need this long code, this one. So use the mouse, right click on the window and click on mark. Okay, and select this entire code including the parenthesis and right click anywhere to copy it right click ok and right click again and paste ok so we just pasted that long code and now type in no integrity checks no integrity checks and one no integrity checks one okay it went to the next line and press enter the operation completed successfully okay now let's restart the computer close that window and restart Okay, and now if we go to Windows 10 and press enter, now it's starting. So the error message is gone. The signature verification was disabled from within the other windows. And now the newer one, Windows 10, is able to start. This windows is running from a virtual hard drive, a VHD file. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.